What's up guys, I'm Kyle, also known as the Panda Man. In today's video, I'm gonna give you the three steps to my Panda method that will dramatically transform your mind and your body. First thing I'm gonna go over is my fasting protocol. When I started fasting, 2014, I was coming back from a horrific leg injury, mangled left knee, worst knee injury on record. And they told me I was never gonna be able to walk right again. Well, I had it in my mind at that point, you know what, I'm gonna prove them wrong. I'm gonna step back onto a bodybuilding stage. And I'm reading this guy, Lyle McDonald, who I studied all his nutrition stuff coming up. And he's talking about our stubborn fat. And our stubborn fat is typically for men located in our abdomen, love handles, low back. For women, it's typically the glutes and the thighs. And part of what really makes it stubborn, it has a very poor blood supply. It's an alpha receptor, different type of fat cell receptor. Now. The first stage in fat loss is mobilization. So mobilize, transport, utilize. Mobilization cannot happen if you can't get the blood supply in. So the only way you can really increase blood flow to those areas is through fasting. I said, man, I'm gonna adopt this tomorrow. And I went to two meals a day, from four to two, same amount of food, I was tracking everything, immediate benefits. You're gonna find it, it will completely transform your mind because of the discipline that it gives you and the self-mastery that it gives you. That's really the key to it. It transforms your mind. So the way I teach the fasting, what I do on a regular basis, I do my black version of the panda. It's a 48 hour fast followed by one meal a day. And I do that pretty much year round. There might be a Monday, usually I fast Sunday to Tuesday night. There might be a Monday for like Memorial Day. So I love it, right? It's very flexible. So that's the fasting protocol that I like to follow. It's very, very simple. That is the foundational thing. And the reason I have people start with a 48 hour fast, it builds your confidence right out the gate. You knock out any fear that you have at all. Oh, I'm going to get hypoglycemic. I'm going to get the shakes, all this stuff. That is how I like to fast. So the second thing that I really believe with the longer form fasting, the panda diet. Now, most people, and a lot of books out there will tell you when you're in this fasted period, when you're in this fasted state, take it easy. You might want to have bed rest, you know, don't do anything too hard. That didn't sit right in my gut. Something seemed off with that because I'm like, if I'm accessing this primal state of fasting, what else is primal? It's hunting, it's gathering, it's, it's, it's exertion. The body is meant to be exerted. So we're in this fasted state, started to really test myself and say, okay, I got to push myself even harder when I'm in a fasted state. And you're actually stronger in some ways. And you, you activate this part of your brain that's like, man, I'm getting in touch with my my roots, I'm getting, I'm getting back to survival mode. And if you could simulate that every time you're doing a fast, right? Every time you're following my program, you're getting this, this toughness about you. And you're gaining this wisdom that most people don't get for the, that just go through the motions. You're tapping into this primal thing, which most people never tap into. When I started bodybuilding, a, a big thing at that point, especially because I was competing as a natural at the time, no testosterone, no anabolics, there's something about the mind this is mental weakness that people are saying you got to train lighter because you're getting closer to the contest. So, you know, I'm going to train heavier. I'm going to keep my weights up the whole time through the prep. And that's what I did. Pressing hundreds, you know, at the time, how old am I? 23, 24, natural, a couple weeks out, 100 reps, you know, incline dumbbell, doing sets with that, you know, 10 to 12 reps. So I was strong and it was just a mindset. So that's another piece. If you got to push yourself mentally, and you do that through the physical training when you're in this deeper, fasted state. So remember, it's this, this type of combination that gives you the self-mastery. That's what life is about. It's about the self-mastery that is going to take you wherever you want to go. And this can only be done, I believe, when you have these foundations in place. And they both start with the physical, but they go inward. They work on your mind and they work on your spirit. So that's how I like to train. That's the beasting portion of my program. Next, we'll be going over the feast. Thanks for tuning in to today's video, guys. I need you to do a couple things for me. I need you to hit the like button. That way YouTube knows that you like what I'm putting out and it'll show you more of it. I need you to leave a comment. That could be a question. That could be an argument you want to make, whatever. I'll respond to you and it, it helps me know what you guys are thinking. Lastly, I need you to hit the subscribe and notification button. That way you'll be sure never to miss anything that I put out. Panda Man out.